to the fog around the launch pad. We can see some of the white clouds there around the vehicle, totally normal. That's just the liquid oxygen, uh, basically gas uh, vaporizing as it comes into contact with the ambient air. Now that those closeouts are complete, as we just heard that call out, we should see more of that. Next, we'll hear the call out that Falcon 9 is in startup. Falcon Heavy is in startup. All right, at this point in time, Falcon Heavy's onboard flight computers have taken over the launch countdown. Great view of the base of Falcon Heavy there. MD, LD, go for launch. LD, this is the MD. The MD is go for launch. And there we heard the final go for launch. T minus 30 seconds of counting. Let's listen in to the final count as Falcon Heavy gets ready to go to space once again. T minus 15 seconds of counting. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, liftoff. stress on the rocket. Falcon Heavy is supersonic. There we just heard the call out that the vehicle is now traveling faster than the speed of sound. What a beautiful sight. Max Q. All right, there we just heard the call out. That is the moment of peak mechanical stress on the rocket. M1D engines throttling back up. Beautiful sight to see Falcon Heavy flying once again. Now shortly, we'll hear the call out for MVAC chill, indicating that the second stage is uh, prepping the MVAC engine. The vehicle is following a nominal trajectory. We will flow a little bit of the super chill liquid oxygen through the turbo pumps on that MVAC in preparation for the full flow of the super chilled uh, propellant. Shots there of each side booster on the right hand side of your screen. Next event will be booster engine cutoff, or BECO. That'll be followed by stage separation of side boosters, side booster boost back burn, center core main engine cutoff. We are about 10 seconds away from the booster um, separation. Booster separation confirmed. And there you can see and heard it by the incredible excitement within the crowd behind me. Successful separation of the side boosters. There we can see three engines on each side booster have relit for their boost back burn. At this point in time, both side boosters are returning. All vehicles are following nominal trajectories. Good news there, both side boosters and the center core. Uh, everything looking good. Side boosters are returning to the coast of Florida, uh, now under the power of three engines. That's a view there of the center core. 
Coming up, three events happening in rapid succession. We'll have the conclusion of the side booster boost back burn, followed by main engine cutoff, as well as stage separation of that center core. As a reminder, per request of our customer, we won't be showing uh, second stage views after second engine start one. Additionally, our center core, or stage one, the one you see there, is expendable today, so we are not recovering uh, this booster.